I'm gonna get over. I don't want to be in this lane. I'm getting over. I got two in trailers. Probably got your goddamn clothes on this. But you better let me over. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to American Truck Simulator. Jumping back in to take some shipments around the United States. We're jumping in with a quick job today and piggybacking off of yesterday's episode where I kind of showed you the equipment that I used for LSPDFR to make all that stuff really cohesive and look good. Same uh, applies for this. I do use a specific amount of equipment. So I'm going to show you that if you guys are interested in it. Maybe you guys want to throw your own thing together and uh, make it. It's definitely worth it. And this kind of just requires the desk that you play on. So nonetheless, let's go ahead and jump into finding a quick job and see what we can get into. We're here at the quick job. Jobs. And looking at this one, we have a Klamath Falls, Oregon to Olympia, Washington. Uh, eight hours and nine minutes. The offers expires. That's totally irrelevant. Uh, it's a pretty long drive, but uh, it's an eight speed. And since we have the shifter that I was actually waiting to record another video of this until I got it's not even the shifter. We had the shifter. Uh, it's this the knob that sits on top of it so we can easily shift. And honestly, it has made the shifting so much better. So we're going to do this one. Let's just take this job. This is not the weather I was expecting. Uh, this is going to be a little shitty, but that's fine. We'll kind of go over some of the stuff I mentioned in the intro once we get on the road. Because as you can see, we are low on gas. So we're going to have to get that. So let's get the uh, engine on. And uh, I am using the knob that sits on top of the shifter. This is new to me. But honestly, I tried it before getting in and it worked so much better i could see why the knob although i read comments saying that it wasn't exact placement it still works perfect and works so much more better with this game any of the stuff that i talk about will be in the description if you guys want to check that out so that way it links directly off to the one that i am using and you don't have to go fishing for it before we go ahead and do anything though i'm going to parking break it just so we can get the wipers going a little bit more and i want to kind of check out where we're going today before anything so we do have a gas station. Oh, God. Okay, we could just go right out of here. It wants us to go left, but I'm going to go right. That way we could go to the gas station right here. Why do you still want me to go that way? No, no, no. Watch it be some catastrophic thing that we're going to do. We're going we're gonna to go our own way. We're going to turn right out of here. We've got to go all the way down and then turn left. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll probably fuck up between there and there. All right, let's get our headlights on. I believe they're on. I can't tell. Hold on. Oh, this is not a dual trailer, is it? Oh my God. Are we doing a dual trailer? What have I done? Looked like I had a headlight out. Okay. Those are the smallest headlights ever. Seriously? Oh, wow. Okay. You know, I really do think we're doing a fucking dual trailer. Let's just see really quick. We take the parking brake off. Oh, yeah, it's going with us. God damn it. All right. That wasn't what I was expecting. <laughs> oh, shit. I wonder if it tells me that before I started, like, in the job menu area. Okay, so we're going to make sure we have everything ready. Again, we're turning right out of here. We're going to go straight. Dual trailer. I'm not too sure about that, so I might have to go in the alternate camera mode just kind of get that started. My Okay, wipers do get a little stronger than that. Headlights are on. We're going to keep the mirrors on for right this second. Probably keep that actual GPS on for right now. Uh, but we could get this started. No, I'm aware. All right. Fucking A. This does not look like a healthy place to leave with a double trailer. Thanks for opening it quick because we weren't stopping. Oh, God. Only in Oregon is there the fucking duel. So we got to go right. God help everyone. Go ahead and throw on a blinker really quick. Honestly, as long as it turns good, we should be good. I don't know how tight I can turn with this before it gets dangerous, but I theoretically it should follow the nose of where the truck goes. Maybe a little bit tighter. Okay, let's shift just so we get some power. All right, we're solid. That's not bad. This truck is just hauling so much weight you could tell so let's get our uh, first nice there we go oh it's just so much easier than doing whatever it was almost like it was some mini game when it really didn't even have to be like that you flick the little toggle switch in the settings 
uh, or like uh, it, it says uh, this is a toggle switch and it knows exactly what it is with the gear shifter which is called a Sima Vertex gear shifter. There's a couple of them. I only tried this one uh, because I tried to look at the reviews. It seemed like some people just have really bad luck with plugging stuff into the computer and it could just be their computer. It's why sometimes LSPDFR, someone will download it and it just doesn't work and turns into be a shit show. But this one seemed to work. Uh, I had to launch the game a few times for it to recognize and play with these top settings. I also realized, hold on. Okay, we're going the right way. I also realized that the uh, top bar in the settings there has to have all the stuff that you use. And I had like flight sim equipment and stuff like that attached that didn't need to, need to be there. So I had to remove most of it. And then I added the stuff that I do use, which is obviously the wheel, the stream deck. Oh, this is getting a little dangerous. And uh, that's some text or whatever it is, the shifter knob on the top. And then also the shifter that sits below it, which is separate. I assume you can use the shifter with anything. Oh, that's a junkyard with like burned cars. I assume you can use whatever shifter uh, you want, but uh, I actually really have enjoyed the TH8A, I believe it is, or could be swapped at the end. Let's slow down here. Oh, look at how much better that was to get to fifth. God damn. All right, we'll throw in a blinker here, but uh, it's going neutral. This is going to be a shit show. I can't see anything. Come on, truck. Why aren't you going? There you go. All right, we're going to have to go for it. They'll have to stop. All right, we're solid. We're in neutral. Hold on. Six. Swap. Nice. So I'll get more fluid as it goes. It's a lot of button switching, but the fact that my brain is not melting while doing this is pretty astonishing, I gotta say. So we're gonna have to go to the gas station. Oh, we're rolling. Lols. We're gonna have to go to the gas station. Not on this side. I really probably could have went in there, but we'll turn left. Oh, hold on. Oh, you can hear the music. It's really quiet. So it sounds more like it's coming through a radio. So we got to jump on this freeway here. Okay. We're doing good, though. Slow and steady wins the race. Am I right? Here we go. Uh-oh, we stalled. Come on. Uh-oh. We got this. Whoop. There we go. A little bit of a hill. Can't say we didn't try, that's for sure, right? Okay, we're gonna get a nice switch. Oh, that's to 15. Oh, no, we're on seven, we're good. Nice. I looked at the mile per hour and it confused me. I thought we were in that gear ratio. So I might not be shifting, I might be running through all the gears, but then again, I, I have something new on the shifter. So I have to make sure my brain is working at one thing at a time. We'll learn shift stuff maybe here soon. Oh, we're doing good. Nice. Let's get a shift in there. Um, but I think for now we're doing solid. So we're about to have to use the second part of this gear shift knob thing. Okay, maybe not. We're actually losing RPMs. 11 might be perfect. We got to get off the freeway anyways. I don't even think we're on a highway. Are we? So anyways, I turned up the radio a little. Sounds more like it would be coming through, you know, a shitty pair of semi-truck speakers, you know? Because again, that's not going to be the... F people aren't coming here for fucking sick tracks, bro. Oh, we have a double trailer. Is this an actual... This might be a truck one. I don't know. It has more room, honestly. Let's go in uh, fourth gear. I mean, you gotta say, we don't, we're not hitting anything and we're driving like, not fast and reckless, but, you know, if Spoonbill was in here, he'd be driving pretty reckless. Next episode, he'll be in here. He's out of town, so wasn't here for this one, but I wanted to get in a truck, especially with this new equipment. Oh, that was a perfect pull up. We just gotta remember we have a big ass trailer, so let's stick to this right side. Nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, did I pass it? I think I passed it. Shit, that's fine. 
Nope, I don't think I have reverse set up. Okay, there we go. I don't know why it, was, it literally was set up, but maybe I had to reset it up. That would make sense. So let's just back up a little so we get to this goddamn pump here. So my dumb ass went right past the one that has the green markers. Why they would have a big ass gas station here is just beyond me. <laughs> so we're going to the one that we actually need to go to, which sucks because we have a fucking huge trailer. This is just a small ass gas station, but we're just going to have to do it. I don't know how I missed that in the first place. We're solid though. Now we can at least get gas. Yep, there we go. Fucking fantastic, huh? All right, let's get it off. Let's get some gas. We get back on the goddamn road. We got the gas. Let's go ahead, start this up. Hopefully we don't have any more hiccups like that. We should be good. Now I know that the gas station is gonna have a marker and that's always a plus, right? So let's make sure we are good to go here. A little bit of music. Now, some of these I tried to make sure none of them sounded like an intro was about to drop. It's hard with non-copyrighted music, but we'll definitely try our best. Come on, parking brake. Get out of here. No traffic? Well, thank you. Honestly, I should be good. This trailer looks like it can turn. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I don't know how much we got. No, it looks like we're good. It looked like uh, both those cargo things are gonna turn into each other. Solid stuff. Damn, we uh, equaled that out quick. Oh, we're just fucking in business now. With this shifter, man, it makes it so much easier for the brain. And I don't even think it's the shifter. I think it's when you toggle the setting uh, for literally like toggle switches. I think that's what does it. Don't do it, cop. Don't do it. Because honestly, that's I feel like what makes it way station bypass. Where am I going here? Pull in for vehicle inspection. Okay. We're going here. Oh, someone didn't make it that far. Rip. A little bit of a detour. How you doing? Nice Crown Vic. Old school. I'm gonna drop this down a little. Get some speed. Although we should... Oh, no. 15. Okay. Respect. Uh, we're loaded over here. It's a loaded off. Hell of drugs while driving. Oh, we also have a... Uh, engine brake, too. That's at the top of the uh, shifter, has a little button there. Let's drop it back down. Nice. Okay, parking brake. To pass the inspection, press enter. Oh, killed the truck, sorry about that. All right, we're good to roll. Sight. Full tank of gas. Come on, truck. There we go. Big goddamn bent over here. I think when we're fully loaded like this, definitely would be a good idea to run through um, one of the sequences of gear shifts. I just don't fucking know. Because I know that two to five honestly made us get up and go in there really quick. We are going fast for this goddamn hill. Are we even taking a highway there or are we just taking the back roads? Okay, we're good. Honestly, it just looks like we're taking the back roads. Oh, all I've seen is cops. There's been no other people driving. That's great. <sighs> okay, this is just, it's, but like I said, made it a completely different experience when you get everything set up. Um, I don't know how to use everything. Like, you know, like uh, the shifter, E the engine brake seems pretty easy. You can slow down without using the brakes. That sounds dope as shit. Thought that was another cop. Okay, so the next thing that I would use, or that I do use, is the uh, Stream Deck, the XL one, that one that has more buttons. That could actually be doubled up, as you saw yesterday, with uh, a profile for LSPDFR. Um, and it just makes it so you can kind of see everything. Uh, you could go with this other one on Amazon that's like an actual trucker box, but I feel like that's not really good at being used in other games. Because uh, if you do want to use it for like LSPDFR, 
you know, as you can see, you could just change the wording around and, and icons and have it be a completely different thing. So definitely would recommend the stream deck so that way you can see what you're doing and then move it around accordingly. Uh, let's go ahead and do this one. Nice. Oh my God, it's so much better for my brain. And I feel like stopping is better too. So, uh, and obviously the last but not least would be the uh, wheel, you know, just pick some type of wheel. You got the stream deck, you got the uh, shifter and then the knob on top of the shifter. We are so far off to the right and you pretty much have yourself a setup. Uh, you know, you probably saw the keyboard behind everything, but that's just kind of there since I can't access the other keyboard on the left side as well because of the pro racing wheel has an extremely big direct drive back end and just makes it impossible to reach over there. So I was like, okay, let's get one more. And that's attached with a uh, laptop mount that I've doubled into a keyboard holder. And it honestly works. And this is better than setting up like a whole sim thing when I do play other games like, you know, Six Days in Fallujah or Gas Station Sim, sim that require me to use a mouse and keyboard and still play on the desk. Uh, I do not take down the wheel, though. I just kind of work around it when I do play those games. Because technically, you only need one side of the keyboard when you play a shooter game anyways. All right, 334 miles. I'm getting so far after this right. I don't know why. 333 miles. Six hours, six minutes. And uh, we got a full tank of gas, so this is good. The rain has been absolutely shitty the whole goddamn time, but I think it's added a nice element that uh, we haven't seen in this game yet, at least. Everything has been pretty sunny so far, but I guess the Oregon to Washington area is pretty shitty. Oh, we really got up there. What's the speed? 60? Goddamn. I can go 60? I guess so. Try to speed it up a little for the other people behind me. They, they could pass, technically, if they wanted to. It's not like they don't have to. Okay, well, are we finally getting to a freeway here? I think we are. You can't hear the brake for some reason. Sometimes you can hear it, and then sometimes you can't. It's kind of shitty. I'm trying to slow myself up a little bit more. Are we really taking an exit? I guess so. I can't tell what we're doing. I think we're not even on a fucking... Like a main highway. Let's check our corner. Oh my god, it's so loud outside the cabin. That's why it's like I don't even roll down the windows because it's honestly too goddamn loud. Oh, we got traffic behind us too. They must be loving their life. Uh, speeds of 55, so we can definitely amp it up 10 more miles. It's just the weather that's kind of shitty. So I'm not sure how good of an idea that is. If we do come across some type of world event, we're going to have to slow down like a motherfucker. Oh, shit. God damn, I was trying to reach for my drink. That was not working. That's like the one thing that is difficult about sim over real life. is like you can feel the car moving at like an angle that it shouldn't be. You're like, hmm, I'm probably drifting on the wrong side of the road. Or like you feel the bumps and stuff of like the, the middle lane. You just don't feel that shit in a game. And you can end up killing yourself and everyone else in a video game. I feel like a lot easier than if you were to like reach for a drink. In, like, real life. I don't know. Oh, goddamn. That cop was smashing. And again, so are we. God, if we didn't have a double trailer, I could go so much faster. I did not know it was going to be a dual trailer. I really didn't. That caught me off guard. I knew it was possible in these states, but I just didn't know we were going to get one. Oh, shit. You see what I'm saying? Oh, that sounds so good. Uh, uh, that's, that's a way to stop really quick. If it's not emergency stopping, that's a way to stop. That way we don't burn the brakes. Oh my God, that sounds good.
Holy shit. You can hear us coming a mile away. We're doing good, though. Shit's not too jank. I impressed my... The first time I played this and then the first, like, episode of Beyond has really not been as bad as it was probably when we first played this for some reason. I don't know if it's just, like, you know, a lot of the racing games or whatever it is, but... Jesus, it's became so much better. So much goddamn better. Trying to maintain the speed a little instead of going super goddamn fast. Okay, it looks like we're about to drive off the end of the earth, dude. What the fuck? The Oregon does have some pretty shitty roads like this, though. One lane roads that are on some major hills. I always feel like we get a ticket when that sound happens. Some more power. We're only going to 35. Then again, I they'd slow trucks down so much on this. Oh, this is sketchy. You really cannot see a goddamn thing you're headed into. See, I don't know if in uh, heavy fog, a engine brake would be the best idea with other people behind you because they really want to be able to see that you're braking, you know? Oh, no. Came out of fucking nowhere. Literally, what the fuck? What are you doing, bro? What are you doing? Why are you playing games, homie? What the actual fuck is he doing? That's the weird... What, uh, the, you gonna go? Bro, this guy's so broken. I sat here for like a solid minute or two. And he's he rolls a little and then that's it. So I don't know what he's doing, but ain't nobody got time for that. We're gonna have to go. Fuck shit up, bro, and see who gets the fucking insurance company called, you stupid fuck. We're good. Very nice. Let's get a uh, shift in. Good stuff. That's how you pass a dumbass up right there, ladies and gentlemen. I got a fucking shipment to get there, and you're over there playing Daisy in the goddamn street. Let's get up to this next uh, gear ratio here. We'll get there in a second. It's so nice though, because I can get this truck up to speed and flick through the gears like nobody's business. Oh, there's other people behind me too. They said fuck that shit as well. I don't blame them. All right, we're shifting. Oh my God, too good. Finally, we're behind someone. I thought that was never going to be the case. Is that a U-Haul? Oh no, <laughs> I thought it was a like U-Haul. Oh shit. Sun's starting to come out, thank God. All right, Tech, uh, what is that, Tech Nama? All right. That's one thing I would like to get is like a realistic truck. So I'll probably look at some mods by the time I get in, but I don't want to. Spoonbill said something about you put mods in this game and when they update it, it breaks like LSPDFR, but there's like no way to revert it. I don't know. I find that hard to believe, but. That truck up there is smashing. Jesus Christ. Coming in hot, too. Get a blinker. Oh, we have a semi-truck behind us as well. All right, we got a 60 mile per hour speed limit. At least we're on like a two lane road, though. We just uh, are about to get to, no, we're still in Oregon, but at least we're on a two lane road. We're in like the middle of Oregon. Of this, uh, this has been a really good truck as well. Like, uh, not truck, but like uh, shipment. Nothing has went catastrophically wrong, except for the reverse not being in there and then also me completely missing the right gas station. Other than that, we're good. Oh, we're going a little fast for a double. All right, let's uh, take a look at our thing here and see. Yeah, we're going through Eugene. So we've got 
not a really good map, but I don't want to open the big one right this second. Still good on gas, so we don't need to stop for that. Dropped us down to 55, not 60. Oh no, I think it was 55. And we're going a little fast. He's going fast, though. Oh, God damn. I swear to God, we're not drinking in this bitch. Maybe we are. I don't know at this point. My God, we're just, we're getting so much speed. I think that's why it's fucking with me right now. Bye, truck. It was fun for the five seconds you were in front of us. Oh, Jesus Christ, have mercy on our soul. All right, let's shut down. Uh, oh, that's not what I wanted. We'll do that, and then we're going to shut down that. I actually like the mirrors being up. I don't know, at least maybe in the start, but uh, it kind of does help stay in the lanes a little bit more. Without it, we definitely look like we are drunk, that's for sure. Going 55 right now. That other one, oh no, it does. It does tell us right there. Uh, speed limit is 60. I don't know if that's for the trucks though or what. What is our uh, fuel economy? 4.1. Holy shit, that's horrible. That's atrocious. Let's see, water temperature is at, this is probably the worst stuff to be doing while driving. 191, oil temp 200. I don't know if that ever moves, but that's a simulator. I don't see why not. Okay, we have uh, 182 gallons of fuel left. Distance, 967. Is that accurate? Because that's a shit ton of miles. Holy fuck. Is there no, uh, like, digital gauge? Uh, we're going a little fast. Holy shit. I'm looking at all my... Okay, we've got to focus. We're about to kill someone. I'm not, I don't know that's an undercover up there in front of us. God damn it. Jesus. All right, let me... Uh, I want to open that menu again. 158 miles to go with 2 hours 53 minutes. We're actually getting the wrap-up of this. We're going through Salem. A little closer to the north side. Once we get to Portland, we'll be extremely close to the border. And uh, I'm not sure how far into Washington we're going, but I don't see it. Whoa, we're going fast, bro. I didn't even realize we were going that fast. It did kind of feel like we were going fast, but not that fast. Holy shit. How do we not get a ticket for that? We have that on. Unless you don't for speeding. Come on. There you go. Uh, we're good in the 15th here. All right, speed limit's now 55, so we are chilling where we're at here at literally 55. We have no cruise control set up. I feel like that would ruin the dynamicness of actually playing American Truck Simulator. Just staying at a steady fucking pace the whole time. All right, we are going to have to get off here from what I'm seeing. Saw some arrows. Trying to get them set up so it looks a little better. I want this bigger one to be kind of like the outside one. And then the one in the truck will be the one that it shows us where we kind of have to go. Might as well use them both to our benefit if we can. I am just ripping past the speed limit. It's not what I'm meaning to do. I'm just... This truck actually has a lot of power when you get up to the 15th gear. It's, you kind of just float along. We got a little hill here. I feel like we're going to lose some power. We're going to lose some power. Nope, we're chilling. We're floating. Bitch, please. Oh, my God. It's just too easy. This is <laughs> such a game changer when you have the right equipment to go along with everything. We're going the right speed limit, too. Traffic's starting to pick up. All right. Let's turn the radio up a little we're going through town here. 
Oh, shit. I see that we're getting over. Oh, no. Oh, wait. I got my own lane. We're good. Oh, nice. Whew. I'm going to get over. I don't want to be in this lane. I'm getting over. I got two fucking trailers. Probably got your goddamn clothes on this bitch. You better let me over. Okay, I'm going to switch gears, get a little more power. This is a massive fucking hill. Let me switch the song here. I can't... Well, I don't think we all can hear it because of the engine. Uh-oh. All right, let's uh, do a swap. Nice. Okay, got a little confused on the gears. We're good, though. I'm getting out of it. That was a fucking hill and a half right there, dude. All right, where are we going? Left side. We're going uh, Seattle North on the five. So I'll probably want to stay in this lane. We got two arrows. Going to be the only chance to stay in this lane. So I'm not going to get out of it. We've got to do a shift. Oh my God. Makes me feel, I don't, I don't even know how. It, it just honestly bewilders me that we're able to do it this well. I don't know if we're doing it well or not, but it just, it feels like we are. Because I think that's what makes it fun. You know, like, if you get in here and don't... Oh, God, I didn't even realize that that was a cop. Um, and don't know what you're doing and just, you know, blast ass all over the road. It's just, it's not the best experience. But if you got it under control, it's really not that bad. Yeah, that's right, cop. You ain't got nothing on that shit. Yeah, I feel like we should stay in that gear. Yeah. Starting to lose some power, goddammit. Come on, you got this. Nope, we're going down more. We might have to pull out of this one and go into 12th. Uh, we're good. Very nice. Alright, that's what I'm talking about right now. Could you imagine someone in a semi truck having to talk themselves up while driving like this? Oh, that'd be so good. Only in a video game, dude. Maybe not. Maybe when you first actually become a trucker or something. You know, it's a lot to, I would assume it's a lot to, to have to go through is, it would be very scary, honestly, because you're, you have all this weight and you could literally kill anyone in a heartbeat. So yeah, no, absolutely. I would I would be talking myself up. Fuck yeah. Just to make sure I'm not gonna kill anyone. We were riding that high gear for a while. How am I, oh, it's 50? Honestly, that's the way to slow down. That is the way. Ah, this is so much better. 93 miles, hour 45. Solid fucking trip right here. We didn't bash anything. I did bash something at the uh, gas station because I totally wasn't paying attention. But other than that, we'll, we'll be good. It'll probably say something in the report about it. In like the shipment report. Or maybe they'll not notice the headlight that's bashed out. I'm just kidding. I don't think we have a headlight that's bashed out. No, looks totally fine. All right, going over the bridge. I think this is going to be the uh, border from Oregon to Washington here. It's still raining. Literally been raining the whole goddamn time. Let's just drop it a little bit lower here. There we go. Yeah, this is definitely the uh, border. Prepare to stop when lights flash. You know, that would be fucked up. Entering Washington and bam here. Nice. It is dropped down to 50 again. Jesus. Christ. They're trying to fucking get us there in the next century. My God, dude. I assume we're going to stay on this pretty much the whole time on the freeway. I guess it's all like that where you have to stay on the uh, pretty much the highway the whole time till you go into the walnut-sized city that's there. Oh, look at him just trucking right along with that little small-ass trailer. Okay, you guys are going to make this dangerous. Oh, you're going to get over, huh? I'm not stopping. I got a full-on truck, bitch. Think about your shit. Oh, 
I probably should have let Jim Bob over. Uh, I'm going to speed it up for his sake. Don't get over, Jim Bob. Don't get over, Jim Bob. Sorry if you didn't want to not go that way. <laughs> That's fucking toxic. All right, we're going 60 now, so we're good. That's a small... Oh, shit. Come on. Come on. Stupid. What are you doing? Fuck. Make me have to slow down. Let me get my power back. Yeah, that's it. Truck along, motherfucker. I have no power. Oh, ambulance. First time I've seen that actually driving and not assisting someone on the side of the road. Am I driving too slow? Goddamn. I am. Alright. At least we got out of that shit. That was a little silly. I do not like that, so I guess we should maybe get over... But if we got over that last time, we would have killed that person to the side of us, that's for sure. Hugging the right a little too much, not liking it. Can it stop raining? That's a cop to our left. We're going fast. I love how it has a good selection of cop cars, too, that are based off the real ones. It's kind of nice. But they didn't cheap out on that. That's good. So two thumbs up in my book right there. Even Grand Theft Auto cheaped out on it. Although you could say it wouldn't have fit their universe, but I call bullshit. So. Might switch gears again just so we're doing a nice lower gear, not wasting a whole bunch of gas. We got 26 miles left, 31 minutes. It's actually been a really good haul. And it's been the first one in like all rain. I don't know if they're always supposed to last in all rain, but it hasn't been that bad. It really didn't change too much stuff, except for the visibility with the truck in the middle of the road. Yes, that, that it actually changed. 110%. All right, we're getting over. We're going to Aberdeen, Port Angeles. Oh, we're going fast. Let me use the engine to slow down. I think we're good, honestly. Ah, that was a clean turn. And we're going to be jumping. No, we're going to stay off this. And damn, it's going so quick. We went from like 20 to 9 miles in like a blink of an eye. I'm going to get over. Okay, that's oh, that's the end point right there. God damn it! Can't wait till we can buy our own truck. Oh, it's gonna be so good. Okay, we'll kill that blinker. That was a great haul, but it's not done yet. Oh god, no! This is the biggest part that we have to work on. Is the uh, fucking parking? Spoonbill over there acting like he's the best fucking parker. Fuck him, right? Okay, we're gonna flick down from all this stuff. Can't really see. We're good. Oh, is it going to be in the home store? Is that supposed to be like a home fucking depot? Oh, God. I'm going to... Come on, people. Oh, you're going to let me go? You guys are so kind. That's not like real life. <laughs> That's definitely not like real life. We're going to hit the sign. No, we're go. I don't know. We had it. No, we're good. That's skillage right there. Fuck yeah, dude. That's how you do it. Now, where are we going? Oh, the back probably, huh? Now, that would make sense. That was a good truck. I liked it. Good shipment haul. Oh, yeah. Keep it rolling there, Spark. Keep it rolling, Sparky. Shit. Fucking gate operator needs to be paid three cents more or something. Fuck. Alright, coming in. Where is the endpoint that I'm supposed to talk to them to actually do this? Oh, I see it. Oh, that looks easy to just pull in there. What the fuck? Oh, god damn, that was close. Maybe this one is uh, to skip train. No, fuck that. We're doing this shit. This one actually looks pretty simple. We're just pulling straight in. 
They got their home goods. Oh, we missed. Did we miss? Hold on. Are we good? Now we got to back up. Oh, there we go. All right. Parking brake. And we're going to drop that trailer. Well, bam. That's what I'm talking about. That was a good one. Holy shit. That was fun. And it's so much better with the shifter, dude. So much better. God, we're so close. Level 8, I think I'll be able to buy my first truck. I don't know if I'll be able to get a 18 speed, which is what I want. So I might wait longer. Uh, we're at level 6. Okay, wasn't expecting that. I thought we were higher, but that's fine. El Chang, the once, or the is cop in uh, Los Santos, also works across the United States there, trucking stuff around. And we're going to get up to like, it's 26, I think, or 24, but we get a good fucking dope truck. And I cannot wait. So, nonetheless, that is going to be where we wrap this one up, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching this episode of American Truck Simulator. And we will see you next video.